Hey you guys, welcome to your bi-weekly love reading. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising for the weeks of March 4th through the 18th, 2019. So I have already shuffled and cut the cards. Let's go ahead and begin here. I want to thank you guys for liking, sharing, and subscribing to my channel. And I ask that you all please continue to do so. Uh, remember, these are general readings, so they may or may not resonate, but hopefully they give you some clarity here. Uh, also, those of you that would like to book a personal or private reading, make sure to email tomorrowstarot at gmail.com. That information is in the description box below. Um, and I'll send you a price list on the readings. If you want to book a phone reading, well, um, I don't pre-schedule those, but um, make sure you're looking out for that notification that I'm taking calls. If you don't see that notification, then I'm probably unavailable to take calls. So let's go ahead and get started here. Um, I have the central issue as the Queen of Swords, Two of Cups, Two of Wands, Wheel of Fortune, Page of Cups, Two of Swords, The Tower, and Seven of Cups. So for some of you, I can see almost straight off that you're dealing with a Libra that has Venus and Scorpio. Uh, but you could uh, you could be dealing with any sign, but that kind of like really stood out. Uh, you also could be dealing with a Gemini, an Aquarius, another water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Or anyone that has Venus and Scorpio. Um, I feel that you are making some sort of love connection. It's very electrifying, it's very magnetic. Uh, you find this person very charming or they find you very charming. Someone is enamored by both your physical appearance, um, the way you carry yourself, your intellect. There's, there's just definite chemistry between you and another person. This could be a new person. It could be someone that you're already dealing with. Maybe you guys are still getting to know one another. If there has been distance between you and another person, like you were in a long distance relationship, I feel that you guys are going to get the chance to connect. There may be... The only thing there may be um, and like you may may have options like there could be a choice that needs to be made between you and another person. And you could be on the fence with who you want to move forward with, especially like if you were already in an established relationship and then all of a sudden there's someone new that enters your life. Now, keep in mind, unfortunately, this can go the other way around. So maybe. Um, you're looking to see what's been going on in your partner's life. And the thing is that they have made some sort of new connection and now they're faced with making some sort of decision or they feel like they need to make a decision with who they want to move forward with. If you are single, I feel that someone has been keeping close watch on you and finally they're deciding to move forward and they're going to ask you out. They want to uh, get to know who you are. And um, I just feel like you guys are soulmates. You guys are soulmates. And there is, it's going to be an instant attraction with this person. The I feel like there are some changes happening for you. Changes that you weren't aware of. Especially if you are a reader yourself. And you've been trying to read your cards and maybe your cards keep, you know, nothing has showed up in your cards as far as you meeting anyone. It's just not being revealed to you, but it's happening. Um, those of you that study astrology, if you've been looking for those marriage transits and you're like, oh, I don't have any marriage transits this year. Or you're looking at your solar return and you're like, oh, my solar return says that I, I don't have a significant relationship coming in this year. Guess what? Something is happening that you had no knowledge of and you are going to connect or meet with someone. 
And you're going to try and figure it out. You're like, where did this come from? Because I didn't see this coming. You're completely thrown off guard by what has happened and you're trying to analyze it. And you are being a perfectionist and, and like, no, I know my stuff. Like, uh, I'm a good reader. I can usually read for myself. You know, why didn't I see this in my cards? Or I'm a good astrologer. You know, I study charts all the time. And my charts said I wasn't meeting anyone. But here I am meeting and connecting with someone. So I feel like you're being proven wrong. Um, and this could be something that is considered like a miracle. Um Oh my God, somebody had like a very good definition of miracle before and I, I cannot remember it. I try to remember it all the time, but it makes me think of that definition of a miracle. Basically is when, let's just say for instance, things are written in stone. And so you just kind of say, well, you know, it wasn't God's will, but the miracle is when God's will intervenes what was previously denied to you, basically. So to, to me, that is like a miracle. It's like, oh, it's a miracle. This wasn't supposed to happen. You know, this totally could have went the other way. So I feel like something is intervening. Well, God, rather, is intervening and is kind of proving to you, like, see, I told you I exist. You know, like now, come on, I, I, that's that's probably the only time I'm approved something to you that big. So I just kind of feel like you're getting ready to witness some sort of miracle or even like, you know, you've been trying to conceive and doctors have said, no, you'll never have children. It's impossible. And so you start moving in a direction to adopt. And then all of a sudden it's just like, bam, you're pregnant. It's like, what? Like that's, that's God's miracle. It's just like something that was denied to you. He comes and intervenes and makes it so. Um, so I just kind of feel like somebody is kind of witnessing some sort of a miracle. Um, who else I feel like somebody got a miracle reading? I think that was Leo. That was last week though, the past couple of weeks ago though. Okay, so either way, there is some sort of shift coming towards you. And I also feel like there's a need for you to just go with the flow of some sort of changes that are happening. Trust your intuition. This is you kind of being open to uh, receive something. You're like, I feel something is on the way or I feel like something is supposed to happen. You might feel like someone is your soulmate, but naysayers are like, no, it's not your soulmate. And you're like, but my soul tells me it is. This is kind of saying just trust your, your intuition. Just keep going with the flow of things because something is getting ready to be revealed to you. Um, I also feel like you suddenly get distracted. Like maybe you just, maybe you weren't even anticipating a love connection. And then all of a sudden, like you're on one path and here comes the tower detouring you and causing you to question everything. You're just kind of questioning everything. You're like, how can this be? You know, this got me completely off guard. Now this can go in a negative sense where you, thought you were with the person that you were supposed to be with and then someone else comes into your life and you're like, how can this be? Like, I was so sure that this person was my twin flame or I was so sure that this person was my soulmate. And here comes this person um, and blowing everybody out the water. Um, so there could be a breakup of a relationship because someone came into your life and just kind of it was like, whoa, 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 where did you come from? I wasn't expecting to fall in love with you. Um, I also feel that someone maybe had a dream, like some sort of information was revealed to someone in a dream. Um, it's, it's like a crystal cr clear vision or premonition, or you dreamed about this person before they came into your life and you're trying to figure out you know, is this real? You're like, is this really real? Somebody pinch me. This is like almost too good to be true. 
So some of you are trying to make sure that you're not looking at something just through rose tinted glasses. You, you're trying to see the reality of it because fantasy wise, this is amazing. But you're like, I need to really make sure that what I'm experiencing is real and this isn't some fluke or this isn't, you know. So I feel like you're trying to examine your heart and you're trying to examine the love situation that you're in. And this keeps trying to come out. I feel like it keeps slipping, slipping away from me. But I feel that someone has a secret that comes out into the open. Let me also kind of look into what the tower is saying. For some of you, this is definitely falling in love with someone you didn't expect to fall in love with. Or like I said... It's happening to your partner like you were you were in love with them you guys were in a relationship and all of a sudden somebody comes into their life and you're like I thought we were supposed to be together some of you is a shattering of your dreams like your dreams are being shattered and for others of you your dreams are coming true So it, it seems like definitely an air sign is disrupting your life somehow. And you might try to fight against this connection, especially if you're already in a relationship. Um, or maybe it's just something about this person that is taboo. Um, maybe someone also could sexually confuse you. I know some, some of you are not going to want to hear that, but that's not for everybody. But for somebody that's happening. Like you identify as being 100% straight and then all of a sudden someone comes into your life and you're just like, oh my God, like why am I crushing on the same sex? Like what's wrong? And it kind of confuses you, you know, it, it confuses you and you're like, what is this? I don't understand what this means. So for some of you, it could be something like that. Um... Or it's just overall a taboo connection. You know, maybe this is someone who you're not supposed to be looking at that way. Maybe it's your pastor. Maybe it's your friend's father. Maybe it's your friend's mother. Who knows? It's just like, oh my God, I shouldn't be looking at them that way. But I feel such a strong connection. Um, I also see this as a possible message or something someone says that throws you off guard. And it's just like, ooh, you just opened up ten Pandora's box. Hmm. Again, I feel that whatever this tower moment is changes your whole life. Your whole world is like going to be flipped upside down. You suddenly have some sort of clarity. <sighs> hmm. Now I'm also seeing this as a visitor. Like, I don't know if like, or are you traveling something in regards to while you're traveling, you meet someone who changes your life or someone surprise surprises you. Um, by visiting you were totally not expecting to be visiting uh, to be, be having a visitor hmm i almost feel like you might have some sort of mind-blowing conversation with your uber driver or your cab driver or your lyft driver whoever this person is like this person is some sort of traveler they someone who does who travels for a living and you're having a conversation with them that blows your mind and all of a sudden you find yourself deeply moved by this person and attracted to this person okay now for some of you it's it's about that visitor some sort of changes to your home 
uh, someone from the past either comes into your life and they, they want to start things over. Um, it, it just catches you off guard. You're just like, oh my God, I remember you. Um, I remember you from a previous life. Or I remember you from way back when, or I wasn't expecting this. You might also receive a surprise engagement. Some of you are gonna receive a surprise engagement. Now that's more so for those of you that are already in some established relationship, like something drastically changes within your relationship. Um, but those of you that are single and looking or whatever the case, like you're having a connection with somebody and you feel so close to this person if you don't literally know them, then it just, you guys, just, it feels like it. Like your souls have known each other forever. Um, but someone is, is offering to take you out or someone is coming into your life to show you that they're the type of person that you can settle down with. And again, we have that air energy coming out. So it seems like that air energy is really profound in your reading. Someone might suddenly decide to move in. Maybe it's a roommate or maybe your love interest. Maybe you guys are taking it to the next level by moving in together. Either way, I see like moving to the next level. So even if you were just now getting to know someone, um, that connection is moving to the next level, either through some sort of physical contact. Uh, or if you've been in that relationship, then it's an engagement or moving in together. I just feel like overall your life is completely being changed. It looks more positive to me, but I mean, there is a possibility that it can be something negative, like you were moving forward in your relationship until someone out of the blue came into somebody's life and broke up everything. And all of a sudden your relationship is ending and you're either moving forward with someone new or your partner is. So I'm seeing it can go Depends on which end is happening. It could be good or bad news. Um, I do also feel like this is, again, some sort of change of the ego, like your e the, or death of the ego, where your mentality is being uh, completely shifted or changed due to this connection. Um, maybe you fell in love and just... I don't know, I just feel like your life, you just, it just blew you. <laughs> it's just, you're just mind blown. Everything. Um, forever change. Let me see, let me look at the Ten of Swords a little closer though. I mean, technically, this could this could be marriage, like you dropping your last name and taking on the name of your spouse. Because especially, too, if you guys eloped, all of a sudden you just ran off and eloped and come back a married person. And people are like, shocked. They didn't see it coming. Yeah, so I see someone undergoing some sort of deep transformation where they come out uh, a new person. Someone comes out completely moved, enlightened. Um, someone comes out acting brand new. <laughs> like there is something. Also, something could make someone famous or put someone into the spotlight once a secret comes out. But then all the drama will be over. Everything is going to come to an end. There's going to be no more fighting. Yeah, someone is being like thrusted into the spotlight. 
especially when some I don't know it has something to do with the past coming out or someone revealing something now also I know air has been coming out a lot but finally we have uh, an earth sign so Taurus Capricorn Virgo maybe even Leo um, also some of you your life could be changing because you're now expecting like I said maybe you thought you could not get pregnant and all of a sudden you come out you know pregnant um, this could also be one of those pregnancies where you didn't know you were pregnant and then all of a sudden you had a stomach ache and you went to the hospital and they're like time to deliver and it's like what like it could be something very crazy like that yeah th there is some sort of changes to your home where you feel s you're, you're feeling a love you're feeling supported praised and celebrated and now all your hard work is paying off you're getting recognized for you know all your hard work in the relationship or it, it can go career wise too but since we're talking about a love reading something pays off like you feel like everything is complete now you're like this is everything that I wanted or you're happy you're celebrating that the worst is over some of you maybe had reached rock bottom in your life like maybe you were like I can't be single any longer I just feel like I'm gonna die if I'm single another day and then lo and behold someone new comes into your life um, or if you've been in that relationship and now you're bringing that child into your life or you guys are celebrating the fact that you just got married you know so something is changing is is life changing for you guys so I hope that has resonated um, Please feel free to leave your comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you all for watching and many blessings to you.